Hello, my name is Rihanna Arana. Sweet tamales are traditional from Michoacan and Guerrero, Mexico. Tamales de elote or sweet corn, tamales in English, are a Mexican dessert. Tamales is made from fresh corn that's blended and mixed into a sweetened tamale dough. There are many variations of this recipe that differ depending on the region in Mexico. Others are made with pineapple and coconut. Hello, my name is Sebastian Mendoza. Pork tamales are a delicious dish that comes from Zacatecas, Mexico. In this state, red chili peppers are one of the main crops. One of the most popular kinds of Mexican tamales are red chili pork tamales, made from tender pork shoulder that's been simmered in a rich red chili sauce. The filling is then enveloped in a light and addicting masa or dough that is then steamed in corn husk on the stovetop for a few hours. Hello, my name is Jenna Correa. Chicken green sauce tamales are authentic from Oaxaca. Chicken tamales are made from tender pieces of chicken, green chile, chile verde sauce, and an easy made masa tamale dough. Make sure to remove any bones from the chicken. Hello, my name is Yuri Calderon. Cheese tamales are a delicious food that comes from the country of Mexico. Cheese tamales are from Oaxaca, Mexico, located in North America. Cheese tamales are great for beginners because the filling only requires salsa or jalapenos and grated cheese. All you have to make is the corn masa or dough, and that's surprisingly simple. With those two elements prepared, it's just a matter of assembling and steaming the tamales. Hello, my name is Aliyah Arcila. Eleanor Chua is a historical figure that comes from the city of La Mesa in California. Eleanor Chua is famous for being an astronaut. Eleanor Chua went to space four times and she spent around 1,000 hours in space. She first went to space in 1993 and retired in 2018. She retired from NASA Johnson Space Center. Eleanor Chua was an American astronaut that had went to Stanford University and earned her master's degree and doctorate in the year 1981. When she was an astronaut, she went on four missions. During each mission, Ellen Ochoa used her physics and engineering to study different things going from optical systems to doing information clarification to electrical engineering. She was the director of Johnson Space Center. She was the second to be a director for the Johnson Space Center and the first Hispanic director. Before, she was a deputy center director and director of flight crew operations. Eleanor Ochoa was born on May 10, 1958, and grew up in La Mesa, California. Ellen was a middle child of five, and both parents did not have college degrees. Ochoa graduated from Grossmont High School in El Cajon in 1975. Her parents divorced when she was in high school, and she lived with her mother and her brothers. She got into Stanford University, which is one of the hardest schools to get into. Her father served in the military and then owned a retail store. Hello, my name is Leilani Marroquin. The Maya is a culture that comes from the country of Belize. The country of Belize is located in Central America. One of the things that define the culture of the Mayan culture is the Mayan civilization. Garifuna is a culture and people who are known for fishing. The culture can be found in the country of Belize, is Latin American, and the Caribbean. One of the things that define the Garifuna culture is the food. The Creoles are native to Belize. The Creoles are descendants of native and sub-Saharan Africans who were brought from Africa by the British and Scottish log cutters. My name is Leilani Vicente Fernandez, who is a singer from the country of Mexico. One of his most famous songs is Las Mañanitas. Vicente grew up in the city of Guentitan, El Alto, Guadalajara. I became familiar with Vicente with his music because of my family. <laughs> Hello, my name is Sarah. Prince Royce is a famous Latin singer from the country of America. One of his most famous songs yet is Corazón Sin Cara. He grew up in the city of the Bronx, a borough of New York City. I became familiar with his music because my family would always put it on for my sister's birthday.